All parties in the matter of Butler Lopez versus Galleta. Step forward, please. Blythe Butler Lopez is suing her former friend, Dustin Galleta, for harassment and stalking. Ms. Lopez, it is your claim that the defendant harassed you and stalked you. The defendant says quite the opposite, that you did that stalking and harassing to him. And in addition, you filed a restraining order for no valid reason and then didn't show up. And you actually, you had not met because you met on social media. According to what I read, you talked to each other, discussed things with each other, and were planning to meet. And then Mr. Gaeta, for whatever reason, decided not to meet you. Is this the first time that you've actually met face to face? Yes, Your Honor. That's what I thought. And when did the social media start? Who contacted whom? The defendant was soliciting uh, clients for a law firm that he had just recently gotten hired with, and I had contacted the defendant for a friend who was in need of an attorney. So on September 30th... So you contacted him? I did, on September 30th of 2016, okay. yes. Now, you have an ex-husband. I do. And his name is? Uh, Lawrence. Mr. Gaeta, have you ever met Lawrence? Never. You don't know who that is. I don't know who she is. I don't know who he is. Right. And she contacted you. You didn't contact her. So the suggestion that he was stalking you because he's a friend of your ex-husband, do you have any proof of that? Um, so I... That they, the answer is either yes or no, and then I'll ask to see the proof. Yes, I do. Okay. I'd like to see the proof. Mm. Tell this, me what it is. That is actually a citation issued uh, September 9th of 2016, where the defendant had received a speeding ticket three blocks down from my house, doing 80 in a 25 school zone. You want to tell me what proof you have that the defendant knows your ex-husband? Uh, I had a file. Miss Lopez, let's not play with each other. If you have proof someplace outside that the defendant knew, because this doesn't say anything knew your ex-husband, which is the reason that you say he was harassing you. I want to know what it is, then where it is. And if you have it in a file, you'll get the file. It, it is proof on social media that they are all connected friends on social media. Well, that's interesting. You mean they have mutual friends on Facebook? Is that what you're saying? Correct. So do you have any proof that Mr. Gaeta communicated with your ex-husband? Not directly communicated, but the defendant did tell me specifically that he did know him. He did? Yes. When did he tell you that? It was within the first week or two of us speaking between uh, September 30th. Well tell, me, well, tell me exactly what he said to you, Ms. Lopez. Uh, during that time, he and I were talking on the telephone, right. both professionally and uh, personally. Just tell me what he said about your ex-husband. He had asked specifics as to um, what had happened with my ex-husband. When and what I, happened? Uh, how we broke up, why we broke up, yes. the circumstances surrounding it. Yes. And um, I told him the circumstances and that I was a victim of stalking and domestic violence, and that my ex had been uh, prosecuted, and I hold a 10-year protective order against my ex-husband. At that time, he asked what the gentleman's name was. I gave him my ex-husband's name, and he said that he did know him, that my ex and he had met previously in Ventura County, where he resides. 